everyone welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to share with you my go-to makeup look um, it's not something that I generally wear every day but on the days that I don't want to make my makeup too dramatic this is a look that I will go for I am using a lot of products that I mentioned in my February favorites so if you have not seen that video then I will have it linked down below without further ado then let's get into the video so the first thing I'm going to use is my bare minerals primetime primer for BB cream, I am now using the Pond's BB cream in the color medium. And I like to apply that with my damp beauty blender, just blending it on my face, on my cheeks, down my neck, just to give me that even coverage and that luminous glow. For concealer, I'm using the Boo Boo Bye Bye concealer or something like that. I believe it's in the color light medium. I just applied that in the triangle formation underneath my eyes. For eyeshadow in the crease, I'm going to be using MAC Cosmetics Saddle. It's my favorite crease shade. It's what I use all the time for a transition shade or if I just want a little bit of dimension in the eyes. To set my face, I have been loving the CoverGirl Get Ready Set Gorgeous powder in the color medium. For the eyes, for the brow bone, I have been using the Naked Basics palette. I like to use Venus. I love that color, it's the perfect shimmery brow bone shade. Now for the eyes, when I don't want to do something that's too dramatic on the eyes, I tend to go towards my Too Faced palette. I believe it's from, it is from the new How They Collection that just came out. I don't remember the name, but I have it linked down below. I either use the shade After Hours or Paper Roses, but the one that I'm wearing today is After Hours. It's more of a golden kind of color. So just going to apply that to the eyelids and then blend it out using the same brush that I used to apply Saddle. For the face, I can't remember the name of this palette, but I'll have it linked down below. But I like to use the bronzer with a Crown Brushes angled brush just to contour a little bit. For blush, I always go back to my favorite, it's Benefits Hervana. It's the perfect blush, like I always say, it gives you that perfect pink tone cheek color without it being too pink. Highlight the face, I also use that same palette that I use to contour. I love this highlight shade, it's super, super, super pigmented. So I like to use it on the cheekbones, on my actual brow bone to act, add some extra color to it. My inner corners down the center of my face and my cupid's bow. For eyelashes, I have been loving this Wet n Wild 2 and 3, 1, 2, and 3 kind of fiber lash kind of thing going on. So I use that and I'm using it with my Makeup Forever mascara. It actually does give you those Va Va Voom lashes, like if you were just to use the actual other mascara that came with it. For my waterline, I'm using a Rimmel Nude liner. For the lips, I'm using Tawny from Jordana. And for lipstick, I am using touch of spice by maybelline i absolutely love these colors off camera i did my eyeliner and it is from essence hope you guys all enjoying this video and i'll see you guys next time 